Hey guys, wanted to come to you this morning and uh, show you my new knife I've got about five or six months ago. It's a Spyderco Delica 4. It is in the orange. Let's see, just the stainless. Let's get out of the sun so you can see a little better. The orange, the stainless on it. It's got the black clip. I think it looks awesome. I decided to go with the orange because it's easier to find if you was to ever drop it in the woods. I've, uh, I've had the black and I've dropped it a couple times outside. It's hard to find. Anyway, I modified this knife a little bit too. I know you've probably seen the ones with the Emerson Wave opener on it. Um, I'll try to put a photo of one, maybe that, uh, maybe a stock version that you would buy with that. I personally didn't like the way they looked, but I've used them before, and uh, I love the way they work. Just the way they look, and eh, not so much. So I decided to cut my own. Um, thought of a different, couple different ways to do this. I even thought about taking and cutting out right here, maybe just cutting here. And there and uh, ba basically making the hole the opener and I was like I don't know I really like the hole I still want to have the thumb hole to open it so I decided to take a pencil and draw me some marks on it try to lay it out where I want it to be and then I just took a Dremel tool and cut it and man I tell you it uh, I think it looks fantastic still got the thumb hole opener if I want it um, works fantastic looks good I'll try to get some pictures of it here on my phone of me um, pulling out of my pocket that's the I mean that's what it's all about that's why we did it right so let's put it in here as you can see hard to tell it's hard to do this by yourself this is a weird angle I'll try my best when you grab it that lip right there will catch on your pants I don't know if you can see it yet or not probably not anyway it'll catch on your pants right there can you see it and it'll open up see how it's hooked right there Anyway, you do it fast, and it opens up. Of course, listen for it snap. You can hear it snap when I do it, you know, full speed. When you do it slow, though, it's kind of hard to uh, to make it work. But you can see it hook right there open. Man, it works flawlessly. I can't imagine it working any better um, from the factory. Uh, looks better, too. Like I said, I'll put a picture of the, the factory one in here. I'm sure what they look like. I just, I think I like them a lot better doing it myself. Um, wouldn't do, necessarily do this to a a really expensive high-end knife. I've got the paramilitary two. <clears throat> I like. I would uh, probably wouldn't do that to that knife. It's awful nice. It's got the the black diamond coated blade on it. Like I said, kind of a, a really pretty knife to do that to. Um, this one was sixty or sixty-five dollars off Amazon. So I really didn't mind doing it too much to it. I figured, you know, whatever. If I mess it up. I'm not out a whole lot, but I tell you, this has really turned into one of my favorite knives. It's my uh, EDC knife. I carry it every day with me. Um, small enough when you put it in your pocket, you don't even notice it. That way, you know, you don't have, sometimes, I, most of the time, I'll carry it just down in my pocket to where there's, it's not actually clipped on my pants. You can't even tell it's there. Same thing, when I pull it out of my pocket, even without it clipped there, I can pull it out and I can still hook it and open it. Um, works great. Doesn't have necessarily have to be clipped to your pocket. But, you know, that's the way most people carry it. But, you know, sometimes you're just, uh, I don't know. People act kind of funny sometimes when you have knives and stuff in, in the workplace and whatnot. So, uh, you know, you kind of, you don't need to be carrying it on the outside all the time. Anyway, works great. Love the knife. Um, like I said, the BG-10 steel, about as good as you can ask for. I have no problems with it. The trick to keeping it, or to keeping it sharp is every time I use it, Especially if I use it hard, I'll go in there and hit the uh, ceramic rod a couple times. Man, it it does wonderful. Um, brings it right back to life. I think the trick to it is don't let it get too dull. Keep it sharp. Um, doesn't really take five minutes, not even that, maybe three, two or three minutes to you know bring it right back to hair popping. So I just keep it that way. A sharp knife is a safe knife. So anyway, thank you all for watching Spiderco Delica Four. I'm uh, I appreciate it. God bless you all. Thanks.